Hi everyone, Habibi here. Welcome back to my video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to export a WebGL project. In this video, I'm going to show you how to build your Unity project to WebGL so you can access it online on internet. Here, I have this project. I'll, I already have made this project and export it we can go to file and then click build settings don't forget to add the scene that we are, are going to export it so here in this scene I'm going to click this add open scenes and then we need to switch to WebGL if you don't have this WebGL option here you need to download the installation installation file from unity you can download the WebGL support according to your Unity version here. Make sure it is matching the Unity version you are using. So, if you have this WebGL, then you can just click this switch platform. After you are done switching it to WebGL, then it is done. You can click this build button. But if you, in case you need to change the quality setting of your WebGL go to this project settings you can click it here player settings here then you can set anything about it about the icon resolution splash screen and everything here inside this quality tab if you want to change the quality of this WebGL you can click this triangle button and choose the quality setting in my case I already choose fantastic okay I'm done with the setting and I click build button then I need to specify a folder a folder to export the WebGL so here inside my directory in this address I can make new folder I call it 360 view enter open it and click select folder now you need to wait for a while until the building process completed okay the build process is done and here I have this 360 view folder with this content in most cases we cannot simply double click this index.html file to run it you will get this message you need to run it on your local web server I am using exam so I'm going to start my local web server by starting this Apache start and this folder and files are already are already here inside this htdocs folder I can copy this address and open my web browser paste it and here I change this part to localhost and here is the and here we go we can look around this 360 image that I've already made it before on my previous video okay that's all for this video I hope you enjoy it and thank you for watching see you next time